Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. If you are excited to dive into another Power BI tutorial, make sure to click on the red subscribe button and the bell icon so that you are the first one to know whenever I upload any new video. In today's session, we will see how to show categories that currently have no data in Power BI. This technique is essential for complete data analysis and also ensuring that your visualization reflects all the possible categories, even those without any data. Now let's dive right into Power BI and get started. First, let me show you the data that I will be using today. Let's go to table view. So for this tutorial, I will be using two different tables. One will be the dimension table which has all the customer details. So these are all the customers that might or might not have purchased from the store. And the other one is the fact table, which has details of all the orders. And here you will observe that we have this customer ID, which is common between both the tables. Now let's go to model view. Here I have connected both these tables based on the customer ID column and we have a one to many relationship between these two tables because one customer can have multiple orders in the orders table. Now let's go to report view. The requirement is that we need to show the list of all the customers that might or might not have purchased any item from the store. So in the first bar chart, you will observe that we are getting four customers and out of this one customer Matt has not placed any order and still we can see his name in this bar chart. In the second bar chart you will observe that we are not getting the fourth customer which is Matt who has not placed any order in the store. So by default when we will create a bar chart to show sales by customer we will get this sort of bar chart where we will get only those customers who have purchased any item from the store. Let's again go back to the table view. Go to customer table and see what's the customer ID for Matt. So it is MH and now when we will go to orders table here you will see that we don't have customer ID for Matt that means he has not purchased any item from the store. We need to create a bar chart similar to this one where we get the list of all the customers. So let me create a new page and from the visualizations let's select a bar chart and let me drag the customer name from the dimension table which has list of all the customers and then from here I will drag sales to x axis. Now let me increase the size. Here you will observe that we are getting only the three customers who have the orders present in the orders table and here we are not getting the fourth customer. Matt who has not placed any order. So in order to display all the customers whether they have placed any order or not we will right click here and we will see an option show items with no data. So now here you will observe that we are now getting the fourth customer Matt. In this way by using this option show items with no data we can show all the categories that currently have no data in Power BI. This was all that I had to cover in this session. I hope this session was helpful. Do not forget to click on the thumbs up button if you like this session. See you in the next tutorial.